guys, it's Zerk, and I'm back with a tutorial on how to fix a glitch for Pixelmon 1.8.9. Um, so basically, you know, this glitch includes a freezing of the loading screen. Um, so what I mean, um, you know, for, for, for you guys, Mac users, this is a video, it's for you especially, you probably could do this on a Windows, um, you know, it might be some similar steps to it, but this is more uh, specific to a Mac user. So. You know, you might be familiar with the screen. You know, you're ready to play uh, Pixelmon. You've already downloaded the correct Pix Pixelmon um, version for your Forge. In this case, it would be 1.8.9, and you come across the screen. You know, you open Minecraft, up, obviously. Uh, you have Forge here, where my mouse is. You have Forge 1.8.9 already. You have um, your, your your Pixelmon uh, folder inside the mods folder, and you're already and you think you're all ready to you know you you're ready to start playing. But this is what happens. So when you when you press click play, screen the Mojang Mojang loading screen. Um, so you know how, you know first it's the, the black screen, and that takes also like about you know say one minute. That's still a long time to load, and then it comes up with this uh, loading screen, the Mojang loading screen. And this here, I the longest I've waited was about ten minutes, and after that I got frustrated. Many of you guys, um, you know, have come, you know, emailed me and said. This takes at least half an hour, and I don't know how the heck you guys have that much patience to wait half an hour to wait for this to load up. So, um, um, so I'm going to be showing you how to get rid of this problem and how to actually play Pixelmon for you guys who want to enjoy Pixelmon. So stay tuned, and let's get started. So first things first, we're going to go ahead and exit out of uh, Minecraft. So uh, let's go ahead. You can go, you know, for easier, an easier way to exit, just uh, go to the Apple thingy right here, and just force quit it. Force quit. Okay, good. And now we can go ahead and exit the launcher, and get rid of that. Open, next thing you want to do, step two, is open up a web browser, Safari, and for Macs, or Internet Explorer, it just doesn't matter, just open up a web browser, and go ahead and look for the, you know, type in Forge, Google Forge. Also, if you guys want to direct, uh, you know, direct link, I'll have a link down in the description below. Check that out, and just go to Minecraft Forge. And now scroll down all the way to the Minecraft versions. Uh, go ahead and look for 1.8 and click 1.8.9. Scroll once again down. Scroll down and right where it says download latest you click the installer for windows and mac doesn't matter and you're going to be redirected Ad to focus a is admin. a revolutionary new way of making money on the internet from sharing links on facebook twitter or youtube just go ahead simply and sign that. up below share links and earn money now right in your downloads you're going to see forge 1.9 go ahead and drag that out and go ahead, exit Forge, get rid of that, and I'm gonna go minimize my browser, um, and go ahead and double click it, double click Forge, but if you get, if you come across this message right here, doesn't matter, just click OK. Now you're gonna do this, right click, and open, click open, and just, click, you know, just click open again, and you should come, yes, you you will get this page here. Minecraft Forge, welcome to Simple Forge Installer. Good, you guys know how to do this already, pretty sure. Um, all you have to do is just install, make sure it's checked at Install Client. Make sure you have it, you'll save it onto Minecraft. And just click OK. And voila, successfully installed Client Profile Forge. OK, make sure you keep note of the version you have, 1.902. Click OK, and open your browser, and go to the Pixel Mod webpage. I'll have the description once again down, sorry, I'll have the link once again down in the description below. And doesn't matter, just go to the home, home section, home page, whatever, and uh, go over to this tab over here, and go into downloads, click it, scroll down until you see this version, 4.2.7. And then go ahead and download that right over here. Scroll down. You can watch the video if you want. 
and look for it, this right here, download Pixelmon 4.2.7, click it, and go to your downloads, and you'll see it'll take about, now it says five minutes, but it, for me it took about three minutes, um, but since I already have it downloaded, I'm going to go ahead and take it out and drag it onto my desktop. Now, what you want to do is go to your Minecraft folder. You can type this in here. Um, or in the description, I will have this. So all you have to do is copy and paste. Click go. Open your mods folder. And I already have it in there. So I'll just drag it into there. I'm just going to replace it since I already had it. Um, that's it. Exit. And now, go ahead and open up your Minecraft. And let's wait until it opens up. Um, yes, Minecraft launcher. You're good. It's, is it going to load? Or not? Okay, it loaded. Now, you look for your version. Go here and just look for your version of the forge you just downloaded for us. It's the 1.9 I already have here. And all you want to do after this is click go into edit profile. And make sure you, once again it's the right one. And where it says version in the versions tab, version section, go where it says use version and make sure you have the right one. Remember how we said memorize the name, the number 1902. So we're good there. We don't have to do it. Yes, we're, that's the only one we have. And that's all. And that's yeah. That's all you have to do there. Um, next thing you want to do is go down to Java settings and go into GVM arguments right here and check that. Now, next thing you want to do is go into this uh, box thingy. I don't know what it's called. And uh, kind of click between the one and the G and erase that one. You can either put two, this is for, um, you know, memory usage of Java, how much memory and how fast it's going to be, you know, how much uh, memory it's going to use. And you can either put two, or if you want it faster, put four. I usually put four. Um, and that's it. All you want to do after that is save profile. So just to summarize, um, what you have to do is look for Forge your version 1.9, go into edit profile, make sure it's the correct version. 1902 and go into Java settings, check the G, G, J, V, M arguments and make sure this is, ch is changed, the one is changed to a two or a four. Then save profile. Now go ahead and play. And it has to work this time. Let's see how long it takes. So now the black screen is popping out. I'm gonna go ahead and show, I'm not gonna skip any 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 parts. I'm gonna be showing you exactly how I do this because I don't wanna, I don't wanna uh, make you guys think it's just fake and all, you know, this actually works. You'll see it working in a bit. Um, yeah, there we go, Mojang thing, it was a little bit faster now. See how long this takes, as opposed to like the 10 or 30 minutes, it, like how we used to take. Mojang. I'm not going to do anything as I said, I'm going to let this load without skipping anything. Man, I wish you guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed Pixelmon. I haven't played, to be honest, I haven't played. Um, I've only done the steps, you know, and I figured out a way to fix this. Um, but I haven't actually gone to the game. So there you go, there you guys have it. It actually, you know, went inside the Minecraft game. And you could guys, you could, you could guys, you guys could check. Uh, if Pixelmon uh, officially downloaded into the into the game by going to mods like always, scrolling scrolling down, and there you guys have it. Pixelmon, it's right there. 4.2.7, little child's mods. And click done. And now I'm going to show you guys how it looks in the game.
I'm going to go ahead and go into single player and create a new world. We'll just call it simply pixel mod, you know, test world, just for the fun of it. And go into creative, more, more world options, allow cheats on, bonus test, off. I don't want that right now. We'll do world type default, and that's it. Create new world. And let's see if it opens. Yeah, it's in a, I haven't, so to be honest, I haven't done this. As I said already, I haven't actually went inside the world with Pixelmon. Um, I hope it actually works. This is, this is new for me, so guys, you're going to witness if it works or not. With me. Downloading terrain. Looks good. Looks like it's going to work. Um, but the, the, the bug or the glitch, the freezing loading screen is, is, is all fixed now. This is a fan-made mod, I'll trademark, so there you guys have it. It actually works. Um, you guys get to choose what um, what um, starter Pokemon you want. And that's it. That was all. Uh, I hope it worked for you guys, because it worked for me. If you, if you guys followed each and every step for Mac users, it would have to work for you. Also, um, Windows, Windows users, uh, it has to work the same. Um, I think there is a video. There's videos on YouTube about about Windows users, how to, how to fix it for you guys. But if it, if there's not uses, see if it works. I'm pretty sure it will work. It's the same for <laughs> Minecraft, the same for every for every computer. Um, thank you guys for watching. Um, that's it for today. Uh, if you guys enjoyed it, and if it did help you, if it, if it did help you guys, make sure to give me a like and subscribe if you haven't for more awesome videos. Take care, guys.